Good morning, Isabel, and good morning, all my friends. It's not morning. I don't know why I said morning. Good afternoon, all my friends. Good afternoon, Isabel. It is sunshiny out there. I saw it as we were loading up the screen, and it was a very happy thing. Let's see what we got going on today. It is Friday. That's right. I forgot it was Friday. Weekend. Who's ready for the weekend? We have an announcement. I don't remember anything that was going on. Maybe we have a campsite vi visitor. <gasps> we do have a campsite visitor. How exciting. I think we'll get to keep this one because we didn't get to keep the last one. Maybe I should get, give Diva her photo first in case they choose Diva. I'm probably going to do that. I'm going to give Diva her photo first. I mean, <laughs> not her photo. I'm going to give Diva her present first in case we get her photo because we got to be close. Wow, we're only a couple of minutes in and I already can't speak properly. I apologize for that. Okay, uh, visitor. I think that's the only thing we really have going on today. I will absolutely. That's all. I hope you enjoy a lovely day too. You know, it's going to be a lovely Animal Crossing day when uh, Isabel gives you the little head tilt at the end of her welcome her morning broadcast hello timmy Forty-eight thousand. Oh, that's because i sold my crops and my fruit i did <laughs> so i played yesterday and recorded it and then i edited it and i had other things going on so i was late and i was tired and i was like oh it had to finish something is it something i absolutely have to finish and so i really debated getting back on and then i realized because i didn't pick and water my crops i did, I mean, didn't pick my crops to sell. I didn't water my crops, so I did have to get back on. So I did pick my crops and harvest them and water everything. And I think I haven't remembered to plant my pumpkins yet. So I should do that soon so that I can make the veggie basket because it's adorable. But that's why I have so much money this morning. You will see me soon, boys. Okay, let's check this. Oh, I got that song, and I got the rain boots, and the chino pants, and my husband was watching one of my videos, the one where, um, what was it? I don't know, it was before this. Oh, where I bought the purple sneakers? And he actually called me on the phone and said, what is wrong with you? Why didn't you get the green sneakers that completely matched your shirt? So let's give Diva her present, and then we will go see if the green sneakers are in the store, and I will buy them now, although they might not be. Hello, Leaf. Oh my goodness. Leaf in the plaza and Ava singing. I have to get a really good song. I don't have a good song yet, but I'd love to have a good one playing here so that they will sing it, but I don't have one that I absolutely love yet. Okay, she's home, so let's get this started right. Okay, Diva. I already checked. Okay. Let's see. Make yourself at home, you know. Here's a gift. Now is a good time to give me your photo. Um. What you got? What you got? Kind of holding my breath. Oh, that's not your photo. I hope that the campsite villager doesn't pick her. Last night I got on and Piper had a thought bubble. Hmm. I'm trying to remember what her thought bubble was. I think she got in a fight with Nate. Well, at first I panicked. And then I think she got in a fight with Nate. And I had to give him a present. So I got um, no. She got in a fight with somebody else. Who'd she get in a fight with? Uh, Plucky maybe? No, no, she did get in a fight with Nate. Anyway, so I had to give her a present, give him a present from her. And I also, oh, that's the other thing. I found a lost item and um, it was for Olaf. And so I gave it to him. So I got to do two villager favors yesterday. Two in one day, that's a big deal. Also, remember how I got on um, like weeks ago? And I got on late at night after I was done recording. I love being outside, too. I'm sorry I wasn't listening to you. Um, I got on afterward later at night, and Wisp was on my island, and I was going to come back and do his thing, and I forgot. Well, last night I got on, and 
uh, Wisp was on my island and I did all my stuff and I remembered to go back and see Wisp. I almost didn't. It's a good thing he moved and got back in my sight again. Well, that's okay. I didn't want that shovel anyway. Shows what you know, because look, I got another one. Hello, pretty butterfly. Anyway, so I remembered to, oh, I gotta hold that, to um, do Wisp's task. And oh my gosh, he gave me a, um, what do you call it, an imperial dining table. That thing's worth some bank. Too bad I can't sell it. Okay, that's okay. I didn't want to catch you anyway. What did... Oh, it's a pilot's uniform. Okay, let's see. I should have opened that already. Oh, that's from Label, because I did her little chore thing. Those are my green pants and green boots, in case I need those for St. Patrick's Day. And I have money, right? Okay, let's go see if those sneakers are in there. Oh, <laughs> My husband and I were just talking about that paper bag. I remember years ago, maybe two years ago when the game was early out, watching a content creator whose villager gave her one of those. And the villager was like, oh my gosh, as soon as I saw this, I thought of you. And then gave her the paper bag and she's very offended and had a resentment for that villager for a long time and I remember just thinking you understand there's like a random generator that just chooses from clothing it's not like they actually thought you needed a paper bag on your head but it was funny for sure <gasps> hey I have a little present for you Robin we got there yay thank you so much Sable pattern fabric I made it myself Yep. Oh, I gotta get the long expl explanation about customizing, right? Well, I don't know how much customizing I'll be doing, but I am so glad I have those patterns. Those are exciting. Okay, now here's a thought I haven't had before. So we can use in-game pathing. and um, Can I use those? Like to decorate with? I understand I probably can't wear them, but could I decorate with them? I guess you can't put those on the... Oh, wait. I think there's something you can put them on. Yeah, we're going to have to experiment. I don't remember, but I think in one of the updates, they made it so you could put it in something. Oh, look. I've even got the Taylor tickets in my pockets. I forgot. Lucky me. Am I the only one who gets Taylor's tickets and then never, ever, ever remembers to use them? Because that's a thing. That's a cute sweater doesn't work for me and I can't wear it anyway but it's a cute sweater still no pants that I'm looking for okay you know what this is cute but it's not as cute as mine it might be cuter than mine but mine matches my shirt so I'm gonna keep that oh I should probably get those though I probably won't wear them but I'm gonna get them just in case oh my gosh look at those socks Okay, honey, I am so sorry. Oh, there are, are those green boots. I decided, I figured out why I didn't buy those shoes. It's because since I'm colorblind, the thought of coordinating my whole outfit doesn't matter. I just go, oh, I like purple shoes. Doesn't matter if it matches what I wear. I don't like those. I'd rather wear my green rain, rain boots. They're so cute. I love those glasses. Um, what about... Um, now, I discussed before the amiibo cards and how we're not supposed to amiibo people in, but it says you can't sell amiibo uh, furniture, like the Sanrio furniture, which implies that you can scan those so that you can get that furniture. If you disagree with that, then let me know, but I think that's the implication there. And if that's the case... Can I scan that and get the karaoke boots? That's, I'm sure I'm not saying that wrong. The froggy boots? Because I love those and they would be fabulous for St. Patrick's Day. I want those. 
Okay, boys. Let's see. Um, don't want any of those. I don't think I have that one, and I like that one. Do I have anything else I want to get? No, I'm going to get that. I'll buy it. Nope, that's all. I'm not even going to look in the other section. <laughs> Sorry I pushed you. Okay, so I'm just going to sit here and say some things. Okay, so I've been chatting with a couple of you in my comments and talking about um, Sunday Flea Market and you've generously offered to give me or sell me some things. Oof, this whole thing about flea markets. This is part of why I didn't do them because I'm like, I don't want to screw it up. Is it screwing it up if somebody knows what you want and purposely puts that? Are you supposed to just go and not have a clue? I don't know. We'll figure that out. But I thought, you know what? If we're going to do this anyway, I'm going to throw some things out there that I'm looking for. And if you happen to have them and want to sell them to me, great. If you don't, not a big deal. I'll find them eventually. So here are a couple of the things. I looked most of them up to make sure I could come up with the right name. And then I thought of some others. So I don't know for sure if I have the right name. Just thought of one while I was in there. That wallpaper that is white but has the windows. Like I have the black version of it, but I would like the white version of it. And I will try to put a picture up here of all the different things I'm looking for, but I'm looking for that one. And um, the old fashioned stereo, that one, I would really like that. I would like the shaggy rug, the brown one. I think it's called the shaggy rug. Um, the worn out jeans in light blue. Those are the only thing of my outfit that I'm still missing because I used to wear those all the dang time and I don't have them now. I just thought of something else. The black chunky boots. Black, black, I don't remember their name, but I'll put, I'll put it up here. And, um, the kitty sneakers that you get from Kix. I prefer the purple or the silver. I don't know if I would even wear the other colors. If you gave them to me, I would wear it for a while, but it wouldn't be my favorite. Purple is my first choice. Silver is my second choice. Um, and then some recipes. I would like the uh, tiny library recipe, any cardboard recipe, any coconut recipe. Um, I need the other fruits, a pear, um, and cherries, pear, cherries, orange, apple, what's the other one? Peach and peaches. I need those. I still don't have bamboo. I'll get bamboo eventually. Don't worry about that, but I don't have it. So if you have it, maybe, um, and then let's see other recipe, the ironwood chair because I use those as end tables all the time and I need an ironwood chair. And then I think the only other thing I had was the ironwood DIY workbench. And if you have the recipe, I would prefer the recipe, but I would just like an ironwood DIY workbench. If you don't have, if you don't have a recipe to spare, but you can make one or you have one, I'd love to buy it from you. And if I think of other things, I'll tell you. But right now, I'm just throwing that out there. And as far as communicating for like a dodo code or whatever we figure out from there, um, I have I have an Instagram account, a Mom's Animal Crossing Instagram account, and I haven't been using it, but I'll start using it again. And you can direct. Oh, I got to catch that butterfly. You can direct message me. Oops, wrong one. You can direct message me on that, and um, we can communicate that way. I am in the mountain. <laughs> Maybe I can catch that butterfly. <laughs> Seriously. Um, what the heck? My gosh. Anyway, I'm in the mountain time zone in the U.S., so wherever you are in the world, we can figure it out, possibly. 
I do have like church and dinner with my dad, although we can reschedule that on Sunday, but we can figure something out. Okay. Um, uh, campsite visitor. Let's go there. I hate when people tease me and they're like, yeah, we have a visitor. We'll get to them at the end of the one hour video. Bud. I don't want Bud again. He's fine. I like Bud. Ugh. But I've had Bud, like twice, I think. Hi, Bud. You are very cute. And let me just tell you, if you kick Olaf out, we are not going to be friends. I'll get past it, but I will be, I will be mad. Okay, let's just, let's just get it going. Let's just do it now. You could just move here. Wow, we go to the move-in game immediately. Oh, now I'm going to feel really bad if I don't get it because I'm going to have to do a thousand other games. Okay, you know what I'm picking. You know what I'm picking. It's always the same thing. Heart. Oh, dang. Foul ball on a par three slap shot off the backboard. Dude, that was like baseball and hockey and basketball. That was kind of a little mixed metaphor there. Um, solid play calling. Yeah, you're the victor. We're going to try again. Here, be my rival. I'll take you on. I was gonna challenge you to a little one on one dodgeball, but I just remembered I left my gear at home. I don't know if I'm up to dodgeball. Yeah, let's try the carts. Although I stink at that too. Red. Oh, see, you're all going, you should choose something else, but with the random generator, it could just as easily be the heart on the one I choose. So it's just, my brain says, just keep choosing heart because it's just easier. So, you know, we'll get there. Did that just say, have you ever tried curling on the beach? I totally missed over curling because I love curling. It's like the perfect training ground for it. If I lived here, I'd be a curling star in no time. You know what, bud? Maybe we'll set one up on my island. That's not a bad idea. I'm going to have to think about that. Move here and be a star. We can curl together. That would be awesome, bud. Really, I just want to be done with this because I don't really care if you move here or not. In fact, why don't you pick Diva? Then you won't have to stay. Well, you really want me to move to Never Shore that bad? Yeah, that's what I want. Okay, we'll see if the mighty muscles of fate have changed their minds. 
Okay, let's try it again. Red. Oh, hallelujah. My gosh, that's a three-pointer grand slam in one straight between the uprights. <laughs> okay, I read that badly. That's a three-pointer grand slam, hole in one, straight between the uprights. Goal! Okay, three-pointer would be basketball. Grand slam would be baseball. Hole in one is golf. Straight between the uprights is football, American football. And goal is soccer or football in the rest of the world. So... Wow, good job on that one, bud. That was a whole lot of mushing them all together. Okay, now, who do you want? That's all I need to know. Who do you want? Yes, go, go. Yeah, bad news. That's okay. Yeah, kick somebody out. It's all good. Oh, I hate clicking this. Uh. Nate, that is fine. You can take Nate. Not only have I had him before, I've gotten his picture before, and he's not Olaf. That's all that really matters. Should you talk to Nate? Yes, you should. Awesome. Well, that went great. The instant Nate saw me coming, he's coming. He started packing up. Okay, I'm not going to click. I'm betting you're going to say something about night clowns. Because Nate's lazy, right? I think Nate's lazy, and the lazies always say something about night clowns when they're going to move out. I barely even had to speak. I went over, told him the situation, showed off my arms some, and that was that. That sounds like you were, like, getting ready to throw down. Like... You were going to beat him up because you were showing off your arms. That's what it sounds like. I'm sure that's not what you mean. He seemed really nice. Kind of nervous, though. I hope he likes his new home. Shredded. Oh, he maybe he didn't say that. He didn't say that. Here it was all predicting it, and he didn't say it. Anyway, what was your name again? Robin, right? See you around, Robin. See you around, bud. Okay, that wasn't as horrible as I thought, and we ended up with a pretty good choice. Let's go say goodbye to Nate. I think I have one over here by my house, a hoppy spot. Oh, kind of went around. I always go around. This is what happens when you don't have paths. Oh. I'm going to miss you. All of a sudden, as soon as I see him, I'm very sad. Bye, Nate. Sorry everything's so messy. I'm packing up to move. That's okay. I'm going to miss you in your little sweater. Yeah, I didn't tell you yet. I'm moving out tomorrow. Well, I wish you well. I don't know where I'm going yet, but I guess I'm about to find out. You're going to find somewhere awesome. My heart has to believe that. You're going to be great. You're going to be happy. It's going to be wonderful. Oh, okay, Nate. I'll miss you. Bye. Okay, let's see what we got. We got to spend some Nook Miles and catch some fish, plant produce, water my produce. Okay, and stretch. I was going to do that. I don't have to do that, but it's there, so I was reading it, and I'm going to do it. Okay. And I needed to water my produce. Anyway, I'll just buy a... No, maybe I'll just plant my pumpkins. I'll plant my pumpkins. That'll count. And fish. And let's go see what we can find there. But I will talk to Leaf. And I'll be back. Just a minute, Leaf. Okay. What do we got in here? Um, yeah, I don't want those. We're just going to go with the bell voucher. Thank you. Mm 
Let's check Nook Shopping while we're here. Wrong. Nope. Oh, okay, I'll buy it. Because I said I was going to add more music. A shamrock soda. I, I didn't buy one, right? I need one. I think I'm just going to get one. And then everything else is the same. So we're going to call that good on there. Okay, so let's go talk to Leaf. Boyd, you are very in the way. Thank you. Oh, I didn't clear that. What do you have, Leaf? Is this your first time? This isn't your first time, is it? On this island? Maybe it is. Oh. Oh, I still come here just like I did before. Okay first time since I saw him on the island, the other island. It's always the most perfect day for shop to shop for flowers. I just wish I knew what I was looking for. Let's see what you got. Okay, I have sugarcane and tomatoes, and I have all of those. Hyacinths and pansies. So I have some hyacinths up on my little burgeoning meadow and I still don't want pansies. Did I buy any pansies? <sighs> I don't think I have pansies anywhere. I'll just buy a few because I need to buy something so I'll just get five of each. There might be some reason I need them. I don't need them for the garden wagon recipe which is the only thing that I might want to make sometime. I don't have that either. So if you want to give me that, you can give me that. It's lower on my list, but it is still on my list. Garden wagon recipe. One of these. Well, five of those, I mean. One bag. Nope, I am good. Okay, um, hello there, Boyd. Oh, did I talk to you? I probably didn't talk to you yet. I'm looking lively. You're right. I am lively today. Uh, let's talk. Every day I take a stroll around here, so I know this island better than most. I'm sure you do. Are you taking care of us? You and Gus can work together to protect our island. Okay, um, I can put this on here. And then I think I'm going to go see Katrina. And, oh, speaking of which. So I got the bad luck with money thing yesterday. And then I went around and did all my rocks. Zero money rock. So apparently if you get bad luck with money, you don't get a money rock. Also, zero bells out of trees. You know how you shake the trees and 100 bells falls out? Or 300 if you have good luck with money. If you have bad luck with money, you get zero. None of them. Even though there are like ten that usually drop them, not a one. What was I coming to my place for? Oh, I know what I was coming here for. So yesterday, when I went to um, Harv's Island to get stuff customized, I didn't want to sit, silly. Um, I was going to take my so sofa and I forgot. So, since I'm going to Katrina's anyway, I thought let's take the sofa and get it done this time. Get it done right.
Oh, I see something. Yes. I see... again. Oh, it's the opposite. I see a grandmother and her granddaughter holding healthy turnips in hand and smiling brightly. She saw rotten turnips yesterday? I think it was yesterday. Holding healthy turnips in hand and smiling brightly. They do this near a small village that one cannot even find on a map. From this vision, I deduced... From this vision, I deduce that your luck with money will improve. Yay! Something good is going to happen. Thank you, Katrina. Okay, let's get back home. Trainwreck Mint Ice Cream is reporting Tango Snooker is go. Ooh, I have, I think I have mint ice cream in the freezer. I'm going to have some of that. Bill, there better still be some in there for me. Yes, please. Okay. We bought from Nooks and Abel's, and we did the NPC quest, and we did the fortune. So we need to stretch, crops, and Nook Miles. Let's see if there are any of these that I want to do right now. Um, let's plant some pumpkins and water some crops. I don't know if I have room up there. I'm going to plant them up there anyway, because... I don't have a spot picked out yet. I'm so close. I've got an idea. I mean, I have an idea of... Oh, I can put that back. I have an idea of where I want to put my little farm thing. Um, I don't really know what I want to do with it yet, though. I should have maybe done that table. I probably won't keep that table. I don't know. But, oh, I love that. I love that sofa so much more. Now, that's... Yeah, okay. I can't go one closer. That's as close as I can get and still fit through. Okay, I gotta tell you, I just, I love that sofa so much more. Okay, oh no. Oh, Diva's here! Okay, you gotta let her come in and visit because I need the friendship points. Come on in, Diva. <laughs> Don't mind if I do. She actually, um, sold me something. Yeah, she sold me something. The other day, which is, you know, a higher level of friendship. So that's good. Okay. I want to sit over here, Diva, but if I sit over here, you're going to go out of the frame. Will you come over here, please? Okay. Kind of in the frame. Look, I can turn. Oh, that's good. How are we doing, Diva? I know I should be talking to you. Ignoring you is counting, but it's not very nice. Okay, I'll come talk to you. Oh, that worked well. <laughs> I guess you don't have to do it very long. Well, I will talk to you later, sweetheart. Bye. Wow. Okay, so pumpkins. Look at me remembering why I came in here. Look at all my pretty beach chairs. I have to figure out what I want to do with them, but I am so happy to have those in lots of different colors. They're so pretty and bright. I kind of... I'm thinking about doing that with those. I don't know what I'm going to use those for. I don't know what I'm going to use those for. But at least I have the ones I like. Um, pumpkins. Right there, right? Okay. Let's go plant those. I'll dig up all the fossils later. Hey bud, we'll see you soon. And she's not home. A um, couple people told me that the Snooty has a couple of coconut recipes. What? The coconut juice and coconut wall planter, maybe? 
Anyway, so I need to be talking to her every day. Okay, this is what I think I'm gonna... No, let's look over here and see if I, if I have room over here. Um, yeah, if I want to do them really dorky. Hmm. Actually, let's do this. I kind of like this idea. You'll see. You're just gonna have to wait and see. And right there. And now it's kind of like a like a crossword puzzle. <laughs> it's, I know it's weird. Whatever. It's okay. I can be weird. I should really clear that first, though. Let's clear that. That's spending, right? Okay. But I also, my watering lines up better as far as the numbers. At least a little bit, I guess. Yeah, I got that one, so maybe not. I wonder if I'm going to do anything with my secret beach on this island. Do you have anything on your secret beach? Are you big on decorating your secret beach? Kind of hit and miss. Kind of like... One out of three islands, I build something there. I made it a cute little love spot, right? It had like a couple of chairs and a, some tiki torches and just a cute little place to hang out and watch the sunset with your love. And then, which is great and cute and everything, and then Red pulls up with his little pollution machine. And I'm like, I don't know if I ever want to make one of those anymore because... You're just going to contaminate it. I mean, I guess we can just avoid it, but then it probably still smells, right? I mean, that smell might linger in that area. I don't know. I might overthink things. That's okay. I know that. Okay, so I cleared that. Fishing is the only thing I have to do, but I think I'm going to do that later. Right now, I think I'm going to go... Um, that's over this way. I'm going to go have my cuppa with Brewster and do my stretching because, you know, those are the most important things. Usually I thought I wanted to start my day with uh, my cup of coffee, but today we had other priorities. Yes, yes, Diva, what, what? <laughs> what? <laughs> What? Yo, spur the moment, but how would you feel about us hanging out at your place like right now? Diva, you were just there. Like, you just <laughs> left my house. Oh, it's like the Animal Crossing gods are either trying to help me or they're taunting me. Here, let me give you all these options to earn friendship points. And oh, yeah, you still can't have her photo. <laughs> I just want to hang out, chat, and bump into someone else's furniture for a change. You know, I do know. Come on over. Let's let's go. <laughs> oh, diva. <laughs> I just. Oh my gosh, it's just so silly. Hey, you know, I'm here. I know you are. Come on in. I'll even talk to you this time. I won't ignore you like I did last time. Maybe you're just giving me another shot. You should come over and see my pie. Look at my nice pie that's cooling right here on my stove. I made it. Cooking at home rocks. You just can't beat making food exactly how you like it, you know? I do know, because I am such a picky eater. Oh. Do you want some... Wow, is this always this fast? Whoa, I totally lost track of time. Guess I should take off soon. I swear it hasn't always been this fast, but these last two have been really fast. Uh, later. Thanks for showing me a little slice of your life. I had a great time. See you around, you know. Bye, Diva. Wow, that was, that was just, that was crazy. Thank <laughs> you. 
My goodness, what are the chances? Okay, let's go see Brewster. Olaf. Oh, I left that weed there because Diva was looking at it with her magnifying glass and like studying it, and now he is. <sighs> Maybe that weed is there to stay. Hey, Olaf, how are you, my friend? It's going great because I get to talk to you and I love you. Another day in paradise, or as I like to call it, never sure. I agree, Olaf, I agree. And as soon as I can get Diva's photo, I'm going to start giving you presents so I can get your photo. I'll get those later. Hello, my Brewster friend. I love the, the light here as the sunshine comes through the windows. It's so pretty. Oh, amazing details. I'll say it again. Nice day for some coffee, hmm? 200 bells a cup if you like. I would like, thank you. Yes, please. That was kind of silly. Those are pretty um, stools. I like those. Thank you, Brewster. Here you go, the finest beans brewed to perfection. Even got you a clean cup. Enjoy. Thank you, Brewster. <laughs> I do like it when people wash the dishes before they serve me in them. I'll do just that. flavor is out of this world. Doesn't need a thing. I'll drink it just as it's brewed. Thank you, Brewster. You know what it definitely doesn't need? Pigeon milk. I'm, I'm just saying. Don't need no pigeon milk. Cool. Thank you very much. Somebody in our neighborhood has pigeons, so I get to listen to them coo and watch them fly sometime. Sometimes it's really cute. Um, actually, when I was like a young teenager or just younger than that, my brother was a teenager. I don't know. He got some pigeons and he had some tumbler pigeons. Have you ever seen them? If you haven't, you should look them up. They fly, 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 and then they tumble like they're falling. And then they go flying again, and then they tumble. It is so weird. Sorry, I got distracted. Okay, I'm going to look at my lists. Um, yeah, we're just going to stretch. Hey, Leaf, guess what? You get to stretch with us. So as far as I can tell... Nine is the biggest group you can have there. Technically, we had um, 10 people because Astrid had her baby, but I don't think that counts as 10. So you can have you and eight others. Okay, has anybody tried to do it twice? Can you do it more than once in a day? We can? We're totally going to do it more than once. Look, we got Brewster that time. Astrid, good job working out again with your little baby. You're amazing. Thank you. 
Okay, so I usually speed those up, but I think today I might speed one up, and then I think I'm just gonna let that second one just play. Just slow and peaceful. Boyd? Oh, silly boy. Okay. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you all for participating, for commenting and getting to know me and letting me get to know you. It's very fun. And thank you for all those people who are trying to help me by offering to have me come to their island for a flea market. It could be really fun. Maybe I'll do a flea market sometime. I don't know. I don't think I can do both in one day. My brain, just not there yet. Plus, be prepared for things to be a little off this Sunday as I'm getting used to it, plus daylight saving time. Let's just, you know, that whole wrench. If I was a little scatterbrained today, I apologize. I got a very bad headache, so my focus is a little off. But thank you for being here. If you enjoyed my video, please subscribe and turn on notifications so you will see it when I uh, post next. My goodness. Okay, I will talk to you later. Bye.